Today we're visiting Solovetsky Island in the White Sea. It's an area that's really, really important in Russian history. Way back in the first years of the 1500s, a couple of monks left uh, the more crowded monastery to seek a quiet life of solitude, established themselves here, and from that grew this monastery. Then come the Bolshevik Revolution, and in 1920, when the Bolsheviks took over, they closed it as a, its monastic function. And it took a new and very black side because it became the center of Stalin's gulag. We're now at Solovetsky Island in the trough of the, the White Sea, as far south more or less you can get. And in the morning we went around and saw the monastery, the Kreml of Solovetsky, very famous, and one of the ten icons of Russia today. And now here in the afternoon we are going to spend some time doing some exercise with robots, go through the canal system and lake system, which the monks built here years, years back. Some of us have gone to reach the Botanic Garden. We just learned it was the summer home of the Father Superior of the monastery. We came by a rowboat and walking up the road, um, but they have a variety of plants from places around the world, and I'm kind of anxious to go look at them. <laughs> 